Hello YouTube, welcome back to our Pokemon Let's Nu- Let's Play Nuzlocke Challenge. Um, sorry it's taken me a while, it's been pretty crazy here at work. So, uh, I forgot exactly where we left off. Um, I do believe that we just defeated the first gym, and, uh, oh, that's right. Um, you might notice that, uh, well, uh, you see, I forgot to save after the last episode, so, um, our little friend Tracy, the Meryl, might have found a mysterious coffin and, uh, gone in it and not realized what it did and became a female. So, uh, I apologize for that. That was just my fault. I'm not used to working with emulators. And, uh, here's hoping I remember to save after this one. Now, uh, last time we left off, uh, I do believe that we were supposed to chase after that Team Aqua Grunt. Ooh, an escape rope. And, uh, as you can see, I sort of did some grinding, and I didn't want to evolve anybody just yet, because, uh, evolution is cool, and I wanted that to be on camera. So, in any case, let's move on. Now, I know I can catch an Inkeda, and I'm really hoping I can catch one of those up ahead. Because, uh, Shedinja will make the next gym, like, ridiculously, stupidly easy. Help me, I was robbed by Team Aqua, I have to get the Devon goods back. So you have to get your drugs back, got it. If I don't, I'm gonna be in serious trouble. Sounds like a personal problem. Well, okay, I guess I'll help. I assume you'll give me something if I do, so. Alright, now let's see here. Uh, let's level up Roy first, because he can evolve next level, I believe. And then we need to get Felix leveled up, because Felix has a quad resistance to fighting, and that'll come in handy. If I don't catch an Inkeda, then, uh, oh well. And it's a freaking Wismer. You know, I, I kind of don't want to catch this thing, but I should, just because more Pokemon. Please don't kill. Holy! Yeah, these things are, like, apparently paper mache. I'm gonna need to buy more Pokeballs soon. Well, whatever. Um. I think I actually have a name for this one. Damn it! You know what? Um. Screw it. I don't care. I'll get another one soon, I assume. So, if someone could tell me exactly where the freaking name raider is, so I could rename Lotad, that'd be great. Because I can't find it anywhere. I assume it's later on. And yes, I just that's a League of Legends reference there. Uh, anyway. One repel. Wait, did I just name a male Wismer Sona? Oops. Well, whatever. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, we should be okay to deal with anything these guys throw at us. My book Pokemon are tough! Let's battle! Oh, this is gonna be ridiculously easy. Speed up. Is that a level 8? Why would you not evolve it? <sighs> Whatever. Burned to a crisp. <sighs> Ninkata. Oh, how I wish I had that thing. Shedinja makes this game easy. Like... I'm not even joking. It can solo things regardless of the level. I lost! I thought I had you. Again, two Pokemon versus six. You weren't even close, buddy. Well, anyway. Uh. Do I want to keep battling these guys? Yeah, I better. I study at school, and I study on the way home, too. Good for you. I don't care. One Pokemon. Uh, I guess it is hard to catch Pokemon when you don't start with one, so... Whatever. Roast him to a crisp. I might be a touch over-leveled. Just a touch. Alright, so who do I want with this double battle? Well, let's use Felix, because Felix. Do 
The dead end up here. I'm bored, so can we battle? Eh, sure, at least that makes sense. Whatever. Oh. Well, whatever. A geodude and a shroomish. Well, I just picked this really easily. This is the easiest fight. So, um... I know the second... I'm actually kind of scared of the second gym because I have nightmares of that Makuhita absolutely destroying me after it gets bulk up. And unfortunately, normally what I would do is go catch a Ralts, level it up into Cur a Curlia, and then destroy it. But that's not an option right now. So I'm sort of trying to figure out what exactly I'm going to do that doesn't require me grinding for 10 decades. So... My, I think my best bet is to just sort of pray, for lack of a better word, that I don't get party wiped by it. Because that thing hurts a lot once it gets a couple of bulk ups under it. And unfortunately, I don't really have a whole lot of things that can hit it super effectively. That aren't going to be reduced damage due to bulk up. Oh yay. Tried to learn Peck. Well, that'll come in handy. Uh, we'll get rid of Scratch. I'm never going to use Scratch. Its coverage is meh, and I'm going to need the Flying-type move, and Growl can at least reduce damages. Okay. Losing made you tired. You weren't even doing anything. It was all your Pokemon, unless you're saying that you were shouting orders too loudly. It was fun, even though I lost. Well, at least you're a good loser. That's an important skill, people. Learn how to lose with dignity and grace. Yay! Torchic's evolving! <sighs> if only you had speed boost, then this game would be easy. Well, whatever. It's actually not a hard game. It's just going to be annoying. Ooh, double kick. I forgot you learned that when you evolved. Um, yeah, we're getting rid of focus energy. Again, uh, crits are pretty unreliable even with focus energy. So, I'm not going to go into that. Whereas, growl is consistent damage reduction. Another battle, okay. We'll rock you hard. Like a hurricane? Meh, whatever. Pretty decent song, actually. Uh, Geodude. Well, this is a good chance to show off double kick. Or single kick. Alright, let's get you some more experience, Felix. Sorry, I'm speeding this up because these battles aren't going to be that interesting. Yeah, it wasn't a contest because you have really, really low level Pokemon. Alright, now that you've evolved, I guess we're going to level up Felix some more. The memory shows I have to go in there. Oh, what am I to do? We were on our walk, Pico and I, when we were jumped by an odd thug. The schedule made up with my darling Pico. I'm not going to try to make that sound. Pico! Okay, I guess we have to save this guy's Pokemon. Doesn't this thing have only, like, Wismers in it? And I just caught one, didn't I? Well, great. Well, I, there's no sense of catching two. Die. <sighs> wow, those things give no experience. Or I'm just way too high leveled. Or both. One Pokeball! Yay! Free stuff! What are you coming? Come and get some then. All right. Kah, key all it all. That hostage Pokemon turned out to be worthless. And you think I made a getaway in this tunnel to nowhere? Then it's not a getaway. I think getting a getaway needs to have you um getting away. Hey, you. So you want to battle me? Um. Okay. Yeah, I guess I do. You could have just handed over the Pokemon in the package. I wouldn't have had to embarrass you. 
me being a 13 year old kid roughly and you being a full grown adult and that's a high level Poochiana. Oh boy, it's gonna be this bullshit, isn't it? I see where this is going. And for those of you who are wondering, yes, I am fishing for the poison. There it is. Game over. Harden, just to negate some of the damage. And you just kill yourself, boy. No wonder you suck. You don't even know how to battle. Ugh, my career crime in crime comes to a dead end. You're a really bad criminal if you don't know the definition of getaway. This is plain not right. The boss told me this would be a slick and easy job to pull. All I had to do was steal some package from Devin. You want it back that badly? Take it! I want to point out that you're alone with this guy in the middle of a misty cave. And he's a full-grown adult. And he runs off. Weird old man. Pico, am I glad to see you're safe? Pico owes her life to you. They call me Mr. Briny. And you are? Huh, so you're a Shura. I sincerely thank you. Now, if there's anything that troubles you, don't hesitate to tell me. You can usually find me in my cottage by the sea near Petalburg Woods. Hmm. Well, I guess that's our next destination. Come, Pico, we should make our way home. Pico? Yes, I just tried to make that sound. Anyway, that was easy. Ah, get out of my way! I'm only battling these guys because I need the experience. Alright, let's see here. Let's head up here. Alright. My Pokemon rule! Check them out! Oops, fingers are on the wrong buttons. Well, whatever. I don't feel bad being these okay. Oh god, is that the youngster Joey? Oh good, he doesn't have a ratata. A ratata. Whew. That ratata is in the top percent of ratatas. Well, in any case, let's just beat this guy quickly. He shouldn't have anything dangerous. Yeah, that's gonna do Jack. For those of you who don't know, uh. Low kick does more damage the heavier the Pokemon is. So when I'm a little butterfly, um, it's not going to do much. Plus I quad resist it. So this is literally just an easy victory. So uh, for my next videos, everyone, um, Dark Souls is coming out. I haven't given up on that. The next Pokemon of the week is actually going to be a three-part special uh, in honor of Omega, Ruby, and Alpha Sapphire, whichever order it is. I'm sure anyone with any knowledge of the games could probably figure out what three Pokemon I'm doing. No, I'm not joking. I RNG'd it, and I got those three. Uh, so, it, the reason why it's taking me so long is I very rarely play that meta game that those three Pokemon are in. So, I had to do some research and do some testing and tried out a couple of sets and such. And really sort of study the meta game there. So for that, I apologize. That's my lack of experience of it. So, don't worry. It's coming. It's going to be awesome. And uh, I think I'm also going to start doing some Pokemon Showdown battles and just sort of uh, play around. I'm not that great right now. Um, I was way better in 5th gen. I'm not, like, it was incredible how much better I was in 5th gen than I am in 6th gen. But we'll have some fun together. Oh, how did it go? The Devon Goods? You did! You got them back! You really are a great trainer! Definitely better than you, okay? I know, that's my thanks, I'll give you another great ball. I don't suppose you could give me like six of those, considering I just saved your job. Excuse me, please. Please, come with me. Okay. This is the Devon Corporation's third floor. Our president's office is on this floor. 
Anyway, I can't tell you how much I'm grateful for what you've done. Um, by the way, the parcel you got back for us. Can I get you to deliver that to the shipyard in Slateport? It would be awful if those robbers tried to take it again. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, could I count on you to do that for me? <sighs> this is child labor, and I better damn well get paid. Oh, uh, that's right. Could you wait here a second? Um, okay. Sure. Well, what happened here? Our president would like to have a word with you. Please, come with me. Okay. I love how I have to have a cutscene to do this. Please, go ahead. I'm Mr. Stone, the president of the Devon Corporation. I did just got word about you. You stayed our staff not just once, but twice. I have a favor to ask of an amazing person like you. I understand that you're delivering a package to Slateport Shipyard. Did I agree to this already? Well, I guess I'm doing it now. Well, on the way, could you stop off in Juford Town? I was hoping that you'd deliver a letter to Stephen in Juford. Who the hell is Stephen? Mr. Stone, now you should know that I am a great president, so I'd never be so cheap as to ask a favor for nothing in return. That's why I want you to have this. I received a Pokenav. That device. It's a Pokemon Navigator, or Pokenav for short. It's an indispensable tool for any trainer on an adventure. It has a map of the Hoenn region. You can check locations of Dufo and Slateport easily. By the way, I've heard that that sinister criminals, Magma and Aqua I believe, have been making trouble far and wide. I think it would be best if you rested up before you go on your way. Okay. Free heals are nice. Well then, Ashura. Go with caution and care. Awesome. Free stuff and uh, a quest point. So I guess I gotta go to Duford. If memory serves, that's where the second gym is. And man, I haven't played this game in a while. I forgot how fun this game was, actually. I might make fun of it, but it is really a lot of fun. It's reliving my childhood. Who the hell are you? I've been developing an added feature for the Pokenav. And it turned out great. Sure. May I see that Pokenav? The one that our president gave you? Sure. There you go, Asher. I added a new feature named Time Bomb. I mean, Match Call to your Pokenav. Using the Match Call feature, you can chat with people who have been registered in your Pokenav. Asher, our President Stone should be registered in your Pokenav. Test it out. Please give our president a... God damn it. Our president a call. Sorry about that. Uh, it's been weird. My computer's been acting up. Anyway, call a registered trainer. Oh, Ashura, since you called me, the Pokenav must be working properly. Other people will be registered, so try calling them up too. Good, good, you seem quite happy. Hmm, how could I know that? It's because I'm looking down at you from my office window. <laughs> See you again. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I better get back to work. Please take care, Ashura. You never did give me your name, but, uh, okay, whatever. Well, in any case, uh, I guess we're headed off to Duford. But first... How may I save you? Well, let's see here. Let's grab some more Pokeballs. These might come in handy. I, I'm honestly saying that because X, de like the, out of all the X items, I've honestly only used X defend and X special defend and all that stuff, and it actually does come in handy some every now and then. It's uh, normally I wouldn't, because I could just I usually just win because I have more Pokemon than others and because they're computers. But all it takes is one unlucky maneuver and I'm in trouble. And X defend does kind of help mitigate those unlucky that unlock. Yeah, that's a word. That, uh, bad luck. Oh, hi, May. Uh, hmm. Ooh, you have an item. Yay. Whoops. Yay. Receive the all- <gasps> Yes! Ultra Ball! Thank you very much. 
Oh, hi, Ashura. You had a match call feature put on your Pokemon app. Let's register each other so we can contact one another anytime. Easiest girlfriend ever. Anyway. Registered May in the Pokenav. Oh, by the way, I passed Mr. Briny in Pedalburg Woods. I guess he's on his way home to his cottage by the sea. How's your Pokedex coming along? Ashura, mine's looking pretty decent. So, how about a little battle? Yeah, I'll beat you down. Ha, huh, you just became a trainer, Ashura. I'm not gonna lose. Just, I seem to recall beating you when I literally picked up a Pokemon for, what, 10 minutes? Where the hell did you get that thing? Why do you, you don't get, like, huh? How are your Pokemon that level, and yet you're all the, like, all the way to the Candlelab area? Well, in any case, Lotad, let's go! Curse. That's actually not a terrible move on that thing. Its speed is already trash. Aw, oh, crap. This thing doesn't... Well, whatever. You know what? I forgot how nature power works in this game. Oops. No, oh, well. Oh, wait, no, I got... I got confused with secret power, not... Oops. No, oh, well. I'm bad at this game, guys. I'm so sorry. Alright, let's see here. Um. Yeah. If you're just gonna sit there and boost, then I might as well just beat you down. That's one scary part about this game. This is like one of the few games where the trainers will actually sit there and boost, and if you let them start attacking, you will lose. He's trying to learn Gust. Yes! Flying type move! Yes, please! Felix forgot Tackle. And Felix learned Gust. Mudkip! Oh, ho, 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 ho. this is gonna be fun. Oh. <sighs> Oh yeah, I'm still really, really, really scared of that Ma Makuhita that I'm going to have to face eventually. That thing's going to absolutely be the biggest challenge. No question. Because I know for a fact that one of the... Oh boy. Shoot! I didn't mean to do that. Oops. Well, this isn't going to end well. Pardon. Whew. Well, that was a bit of a misplay on my part. I didn't mean to just mash A and hit absorb again, but it happened. Yikes! You're better than I expected! Yeah, I'm kinda badass. I still want to know where you got that fucking Torkoal. Oh, by the way, Mr. Briney, who I just passed, uh, sure, you just moved here, so you might not know this, but Mr. Briny was once a revered seafarer. Huh. Well, I guess... I looked at the town maps, clearly, and, uh, I know that Juford is across the sea, so, uh... Hmm, I wonder if I have to go talk to this guy. No one ever accused Pokemon of having the most complex of storylines. Actually, that's not true. The later games actually got pretty decent stories. Uh, namely, uh, X and Y with Team Plasma, or not X and Y, uh, Black and White with Team Plasma, or, go yeah, Plasma. It's Plasma, and then Team Blaze It, 420 Blaze It, and, yeah. That was just a weird evil team. Well, in any case, what the hell is going on in here? Oi, you. Oh, boy. Mr. Ryan, hold on, last. Wait up, Pika. Did you just call me a girl? Yo, sure. You saved my darling Pika. We owe so much to you. What's that? You want to sail with me? <laughs> you have a letter down for Duford and a package for Slayport, then. 
Quite the busy life you must lead. Well, this isn't really my choice, but yeah, I guess you could call it busy. But certainly, what you're asking is no problem at all. You've come to the right man. We'll set sail for Dewford. Dewford it is then! Anchors away! Pico, we're setting sail, my darling! Lol. I don't know why I find this guy funny. Huh? Oh, Asha? Where are you now? It sounds windy wherever you are. Yeah, screw you, Dad! I just heard from Devon's Mr. Stone about your poking head. Just said to give you a call. It sounds like you're doing fine, so that's fine with me. You take care now. Short. Worst dad ever. Isn't there when you move in. Doesn't get help you with your Pokemon. <sighs> doesn't even give you a fucking allowance. Doesn't even hold money onto you for each of your victories. So you save money up. And be a responsible adult. Ahoy! We've hit Landon Dewford. I suppose that you're off to deliver that letter. Who to... Who was it now? Steven! That's right. Nope. That's very nice that he's waiting. Well, in any case, I'm gonna go heal up, and I guess we'll go into the cave. Part of me... Okay, um, I have a second chance at this. There's, I believe, Sableye in the cave up north. If I get one of those, this gym becomes easy. Or a Metatite. I think those are also in that cave. I swear to god if you have three fucking magic carbs. What do people do if they need to go to a washroom? What if my rod books a big one while I'm in the washroom? I just can't go. Then you pull up your rod, you put it away, and then you go to the restroom, and then reset your rod. Okay, good, you don't have three magic carbs. Whew. Uh, huh. Interesting. Let's just see how much damage this does. Those things are usually- HOLY CRAP! Those things are pathetically weak defensively on the physical side. But confusion will be confusion! <sighs> what a pain. Oh dear. You fucker. I'm not risking this. Nope, 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 not risking it. I am not losing Felix. No way, no how. Freaking critical. And poison? Really? This game cheats, I swear. Someone want to do the math of that, the probabilities? I think Poison Sting has like a 20% chance of poison. Crits have like a... Have a ridiculously small critical hit chance anyway. Uh, sorry about the screen, guys. My I keep hitting my Windows key. It says I have Windows frickin' 8. It opens up random shit. And also because I'm trying not to go to the washroom. Uh, you also only have wild Pokemon and I had more than that. Ow, ow, ow. No. Don't die, Pokemon friends. That's one really nice feature in later games where poison only leaves you down to one health and it doesn't kill you. That's really, really nice for Nuzlocks. Thank you for waiting. We restored your Pokemon to full health. Yes, Mr. Joy. We have to see you again. Uh, that line has always been really, really bad. You want to see people again in the hospital? Jerk. No, I don't want to battle you. I just want to go into this cave and see what my catch is. And it is a... Fucking Zubat. I almost forgot these things existed. Well, whatever. I swear to god, if this kills it, I'm gonna be upset. Well, at least it has a quad resistance to fighting. And it can learn supersonic, so I guess it'll come in handy. 
Am I really just uh, catching a Zubat? I hate Zubat. Although Crobat's actually pretty good. So maybe I will use it. But oh no, Brave Bird isn't it doesn't exist yet. Oh, Brave Bird everything. While living in pitch black cavern, their eyes gradually grew shut and depraved the, deprived them of vision. They use ultrasonic waves to detect obstacles. Hmm. I actually know what to call this guy. It's all another League of Legends pun. I won't be able to... Oh no, now I can't evolve him! Because then he'll be able to see. Oh well. One escape rope. That'll come in handy. Alright, let's see what we have in here. An Aeron. I would have loved to catch one of those for late game, but it's just not worth it. Oh well. Time to get a little bit of training in. You can increase your physical defense all you want. It's not going to help you. Alright, so uh, I'm just going to grind up a bit, I guess. A Zubat. Okay, that's fine. If I can just get Felix to be stronger, then I should be able to have very little issues with that thing. With that Makuhita. I think it's level 19? I think? Well, in any case... I forget, I don't even remember Makuhita's ability. I think it's Guts. Which can be really annoying if I accidentally status it. One Pokeball. Uh, wandering around in the dark. Another Zubat. Let's beat it down. One well, case, uh... but yeah, um, another video that's coming out is another deck garage, which will, which I think is another really fun deck. At least it's one of I have fun with it. I don't can't say the same for my opponents, but uh, I really like it. So we'll see what happens here. Uh, oops! Wow, that did nothing to this one. Oh, it's level 11, too. That's why. Well, in any case, we'll gradually fight this thing down. Yes. Boop. Easy. GG, easy. I hate it when people say that. It's so disrespectful and cruel. Even if it is true and you completely destroy your an enemy... You shouldn't mock them because they lost. They could have just been having a bad day. That's my philosophy. Whatever. Hello and welcome to the Pokemon Center. I'll heal up. Um. If. Huh. Well, I guess I'll just stop it here, guys. Uh, I know we didn't get to do a whole lot. Um, I'm just looking at the time, and it has been a, quite a few minutes. Uh, this is going to be a fairly long episode. Um, but next episode, we're go I'm going to, after I've grinded up a bit, we're going to be taking on gym number two, Broily. I mean, Brawly. Uh, in any case, um, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys again. Gaming Ninja signing out.